Hey guys, MiljoA here, JML Gaming. Today I'm going to show you a tutorial on how to build a vertical sliding door. If you've already watched my ver uh, my horizontal sliding door, it's pretty much almost the same, but I do this a little more advanced. With me today, I have my friend Studley Studog. He does have a YouTube channel, but he does not have many videos up yet. It's just one MW3 montage. It's not edited yet, so he doesn't really care if you mo check that out or not. But Go ahead and spam on Xbox for me. <laughs> but uh, yeah, you see, this is my new tutorial area. My friend uh, Stalin32 and Studley Studog helped me uh, flatten out and build up around, and I put the names in the wall for this tutorial. And yeah, let's get started. For this, you're going to need uh, sticky pistons. Obviously, you don't need much. You just need eight. But uh, You'll need redstone, redstone repeaters, and once again, always your building block you want. Right there, you're going to build five up from the ground, and you'll just build those across the top. And it should look like that so far. So You can, you can go ahead and build that just to check if it works, and you see that it does once we you're not going to be using any redstone torches, we're just going to. It's just to make sure it works, that's all. So now you're going to dig out this ground all the way around this. Even that part, just because it looks better. Not that. Come on, get there. Yeah, there it is. Don't dig that one out. But you just dig all the way around it. <coughs> Sorry. But, uh, this is where your repeaters are gonna go. But as you see, we still have to dig out a little more, so you have to dig one more layer out on each side. Thank you, G. Now you just lay the redstone repeaters up against it on each side. You will need 16 redstone repeaters, by the way. And you just wire it up like that, or all the way around. You won't need 16 repeaters, actually. You'll only, you'll only need 12. But I, f I uh, forgot I'm not going to do it that way. I'm going to just put one repeater on the top. Not one repeater, but... One row of four. He's over there making love to that chicken. I see. Huh. Anyways, this is the part where you have to build up for the repeaters and wiring up here. So you just have to. I'm showing you what you shouldn't like do. Like you gotta find the perfect spot for it. Like right here, and you want the top row to be covered like that so that's where the repeaters are gonna go now you just have to make a spot for the redstone wiring so you just put four back behind that place your four repeaters get your redstone down then we have to finish building the path up ooh it's a little laggy there sorry oh that that's better now we're going to have to build out a little bit on this part for another repeater. So technically you do need 13, but I just make this like a double going up. So just wire it up here. Place one right there. Place a repeater, and as you see, it's not going to work. I'm going to have him test it out for me. Well, I was, but he... He's over there doing something with a chicken. I'm just gonna cover this up for now. You can cover it up with whatever you want. But just to show you it doesn't work yet, and I'll show you why. It's not flowing that current. So what you gotta do is uh, you gotta place one redstone wire on the other side, and it works. It, it's a fully vertical sliding door. You could build it way higher, but it takes so much more work. 
You'd have to do what I already showed you in my piston gate door tutorial. You have to build it with uh, several pistons on the top and everything to control each piston. So yeah, that could be tricky. So you don't need all this excess block. I mean, it doesn't look. It's not hurting anything, but like that, you don't need that or that. Of course, we'll keep that back there anyways, but... Yeah, that's your main sliding door. He just hit the switch, that's all. <coughs> and then we'll cover this up. You can't cover that hole up right there, so... Right now, we're just going to cover this up here just around that so it's, you could do it whatever way you want I'm just gonna do it the quickest way because I'm lazy usually I don't like to use cobblestone too much but it doesn't hurt anything whoops part's not important, but... I mean, if you want to make it more hidden, you can do whatever you want. Just don't cover any wire. Like, don't place a block on top of any wire like I just did that goes up to another block. Because that will cancel the redstone wiring. Just making sure this works still. I couldn't. I can't remember if it does. Yeah, it works. Looking at it. Yeah, it works. All right. <coughs> so you cover that up. You just you can do that. You don't even have to do this part of the tutorial. But it does work. You guys know that now. Figured I put a tutorial up for you. I told you guys I would since I got 300 more video views. I guess I got 45 last night, just in within 12 hours. Well, that's not bad. But yeah, you could put that on the inside, and that's how my locking doors work I in my house, if you've seen my first video, and uh, whatnot, but uh, I have vertical and horizontal sliding door in my house, both in the same spot to open my house. It's horizontal, and then to get into my house house, it's vertical, and it's a hidden door. You can hide it so easily. And see, it's locked right here. Since he closed it on that side, you can't open it from this side without him opening first. And that, that's pretty much how that works with the locking mechanism. I mean, it, it can get aggravating if your friends try to get in and then they keep uh, hitting it and because it won't let them in. And then you're locked in and they can't get in, so... You just have to talk to them after they do that and tell them to hit it one more time, then you have to hit it one more time, and it's just a whole lot of confusing. I mean, if you can put it on one side and wire it up there, you can do whatever you want, but, like, so you can access it from both sides, but that's pretty much all that. Now, if you guys, my next tutorial will be up sometime it might be up whenever I get 400 video likes, but I do not know what to do, so I have to get some time to think and build up stuff that nobody has up on YouTube much, because everybody has this type of stuff up on YouTube. <clears throat> I think I might just make a cannon and put it up or something, or a piston elevator maybe. Not the one I have, but one, I guess. But, anyways... I have no clue. Studley Stew Dog was a help today, actually. 
He was here helping me out on this. Just making sure I had all my supplies in check and whatnot. You can see there he is right there. And it says my gamer tag is still Rebel Paint Job 68. It is not. It is XXMilJ08 now for my channel. And uh, yeah, <clears throat> if you guys like this, please comment, like, rate, subscribe, whatever. And keep watching my videos. <clears throat> and keep liking my videos. See you guys.